Well, hi everybody. How really, really nice for Hannah and me to get a chance to talk to all of you. Hi everyone. It's really lovely to see you all. I have heard, we have heard from Mrs. Stouffer that you are learning about roles in the church. Now, another person who looks a bit like us, but who is a man, is Reverend Colin. He's going to be talking to you about roles in the church as well. We're all going to be making videos for you. I think that whatever church you belong to, Reverend Colin belongs to the Methodist Church, Hannah and I belong to the Anglican Church, or what's called the Church of England. The most important person with a role in any church is, you might recognise him, can you remember? He featured in our videos, actually, Jesus Christ, the real boss of any church, the real person whom Christians try to follow to run their churches is Jesus Christ. And one of the ways Christians find out about Jesus Christ is, you know, from the Bible. But different churches organise themselves in different ways. In the Church of England, we have people called bishops. Here are the two bishops who are responsible for our diocese, our area. This one is Bishop Stephen, the man, and this one is Bishop Dagmar, the lady. So they are sort of responsible for looking at all the churches in our area, all the Anglican churches, and helping us live our lives in the way that Jesus Christ would want to live them, trying to build God's kingdom in this place. Now, I am the vicar of Soham. Hannah's going to tell you who she is. So I'm the curate, which is a word you might not have heard before, but a curate means that I'm still learning. Eleanor is teaching me how to be a vicar and how to do all of the different things that a vicar needs to do. And I still go to lessons a little bit like your lessons with other curates too. So, Hannah said something there. She said, Eleanor is teaching me how to be a vicar. A vicar is in charge of the church in an area, in what's called a parish. Our parish is the parish of Soham. But do you know what? It's actually not just me who's doing the teaching. Do you know what? I'm also doing the learning. I learn from Hannah. And Hannah actually learns from all of you as well. So do I. That is a really important thing about the church. When Jesus was alive, after he had died and Christians believe had risen again, there was a man called St Paul and St Paul wrote letters to the little tiny churches that were around after Jesus had risen from the dead. Christians got together and prayed and talked about what Jesus had done and St wrote to the Christians in a place called Corinth. He said, the church is a body. A body. The church, he said, is the body of Christ. The church's job, and it doesn't matter if it's a Methodist church or an Anglican church or a Baptist church or a Catholic church, the church's job is for every Body who is a member of that church to work together like a body. So maybe my job is to be a hand. Maybe Hannah's job, Hannah think of something. Maybe my job is to be a foot. <laughs> maybe somebody else's job is to be the heart. Maybe somebody else's job, maybe there are people who think I don't have much of a job. I'm too old, or I'm too young, or I'm too stupid. That's what people think, you know, and they're wrong because everybody is really important. Did you know if you haven't got a big toe, it is really difficult to stand up? 
a big toe just looks like a little thing. Maybe it's a bit like somebody who thinks, I'm no good, I haven't got a job. Well, yes, you have. Maybe you're the big toe. Maybe without you, you can't stand up. We're going to go quickly into the church and I'm going to show you some of the people who have got jobs that have got names in our church. Let's go inside. So I'm standing in St Andrew's Church and here we have got photographs of some people whose jobs in the church, whose roles have got names. You can see here somebody we were looking at earlier. Here is Hannah, the curate. Here is a lady called Susan, PCC member. PCC member is a bit like your school council. A PCC is the parochial church council. And these different people are members of that council who think together. Here is a man called Simon. Now, some of you might know Simon. You might well know Simon. Simon's job, can you see it says treasurer? He doesn't look for treasure. He helps with the money. He's got a role in the church. But now, have a look at all these seats. Now, there's no one sitting on these seats. But do you remember what I said? The body of Christ. This is where the people sit. The people who might be the hands, who might be the feet, who might be the big toes, who might be the hearts. And you know what? The body of Christ, it's not just them. It's all the Christians everywhere. Christians in the Methodist Church, Christians in the Catholic Church, Christians everywhere who have a job. Maybe the children, before COVID, our children in the church used to be so helpful, helping tell the stories of Jesus to us, the grown-ups. And it's been really annoying because we haven't been able to do that kind of stuff because of COVID, but I hope we'll be able to, uh, to do that again. So Paul writes, when he's writing to the churches, he says, we are the body of Christ. And he says, the head of that body is Jesus himself. Jesus who helps us all with all our different roles to work together to do Jesus's work in our world. That's the end of this week's That's the end of this week's video. Hannah's going to do a video for you next week. Have fun with your learning. Bye. Oh, he's waving. Bye-bye.